Ladies and gentlemen, the volcano has erupted. I'm your host, Diamond, from the Oppenheimer Ranch Project Magnetic Reversal News and Shinrin Yoku. And Reykjanes volcano in Iceland erupts in fountains of lava. Well, that's what they say. And here you can see the glow from the capital city, Reykjanes, as Fagrarosval, mountain, finally erupts. Now, the fissure opened up is about 200 meters and growing. And let's just read what they have to say. A long dormant volcano in southwest Iceland erupted Friday, some 40 kilometers from the capital Reykjavik, the Iceland Met said. Local media reported inbound and outgoing air traffic had been halted from Kefalov International Airport, the country's largest servicing the capital. Color code is currently red. The Met office reported the volcanic eruption near Fadgradal's Mountain, 8.45 p.m. local time, declaring the flight, flight color code red. But very little turbulence is seen in seismometers. So, yeah, the seismos, we'll get to that in a moment. The fissures caused by the eruption now is 500 meters here, roughly 1,640 feet long. According to the National Weather Service, the Coast Guard said lava appears to flow slowly as they shared aerial videos of the eruption. We're going to show you some spectacular footage of that. First, we'll come over to the seismos at the Reykjanes Ridge in the peninsula. As you can see, that's quieted down over the last, since three weeks ago or two weeks ago. In fact, the eruption had happened when there was almost no seismic activity, which we pointed out over the last week, that would be the signal before the eruption. And certainly it was in this case. And that is the main area of the fissure up here. You can see it, more cracking of it. So it kind of curves from this direction and the lava is flowing from the center, the center portion and the upper portion of the rift. So the rifting is here and we're going to see that in the video in just a second. Now let's take a quick look at what Iceland geology has to say. The volcano eruption seems to have started without any earthquake activity or major harmonic tremor as of writing this article. More information later this evening. There is a web camera link here in Ruv. It might work, but the web cameras are getting heavy traffic now. This drop dot here is the possible location of the eruption based on satellite images of the area. And Iceland, they've concluded that it is the Kreisjevik Trolldinjagja volcano. And let's see if we can pronounce that again. It's the Kreisjevik or the Kreisjevik Trolldinjagja. Nagja. Trolldinjagja. Now, this volcano hasn't erupted since 1340. Like most of the Reykjanes Ridge hasn't erupted in over 700 years. The Volcanic Explosive Index historical documentation has it at VEI 1 and 2 through tephrochronology and historical observation. And so that's what we should expect from this eruption. But like I said before, in our historical analysis of what happens during Reykjanes Ridge eruptions, uh, doing a geological historical analysis, We've determined that when the volcanoes in this region, which are the fissure type eruptions with lava flows erupt, uh, what also happens then is other volcanoes on the island begin to erupt. So we should be looking at Kafla or a different volcano like Bartabunga maybe to get active in the coming days or weeks as this fissure eruption uh, becomes more active and spreads. And we have some amazing footage, so take a look. And so what we can see here is what the last four weeks, this magma moving into this sheeted dike has built up a lot of pressure, has melted the, the host rock in the region. And now we're seeing a, a, a mix of that intruded magma plus the host rock now coming out in the surface. Quite fascinating. Now, because of the long lasting type of eruption this is, uh, what we're gonna expect to see is that over the hours and days, this lava is gonna make its way towards cities and roads. So we will have more clear information as time moves forward. This has just begun. Later tonight, I'll do a full update on magnetic reversal news. 
uh, which will have some more info on this eruption. So go check us out there and check us out in the morning as we update the Iceland volcano as it happens before your very lives. Now, based on this footage, it appears as if the lava has moved at least a half a mile, probably a mile by now or more. So we're going to be getting updates on where they think that this is going to go and how it may affect the island definitely by the morning. So we have an ongoing story. Iceland has erupted. It's Kreishevik. Um, it's a multi-named. It's Kreishevik Trolldegnaja volcano, which is on Fagradusfall Mountain, as predicted uh, by this channel three years ago. And more recently, the eminent eruption predicted uh, over a month ago, before the mainstream hit it, we hit it days before anyone took, had a whiff. So those are the facts. Iceland is erupting, and we're reporting on it before your very lives. Uh, check out icelandgeology.net for uh, updates. I'll leave you links to everything we've showed you tonight. And be safe, and that's a boom to knowledge. Check out the full update later for more information on the ongoing eruption in Iceland. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Thanks for watching. Be safe, we love you, and that's a boom to knowledge. Click on one of the other boxes to gain more knowledge. Be safe.